Cool. All right. Welcome back to our Monster Hunter escapades. Beef King Cell is looking like somebody out of fucking Ronin Kenshin Samurai. I don't think we can talk about that series anymore considering the guy went to jail for some uh, pretty pretty, pretty shady shit. All right. Signed. Blooming, ballooning problems. Let's, let's go, Beef. Let's ballooning our problems. Oh my god, I can't join you because I'm too OP. What? Really? That's literally what it said, yep. It said you're too overpowered? Yep. Uh, no, should I set a password? Okay, so post a new quest. That's great. Assigned ballooning problems. The passcode is going to be 5665. Now, I hope you got a good enough memory because I'm not going to remember that at all. Your cat looks like a, um, a daigoro. So that's pretty cool. Hey, question. Yo. Can you hear my dryer? I'm glad that's a no, because I was really worried that was going to get picked up in the recording. <laughs> no, I can't hear it. Not like that mow mowing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the room became amazingly hot really quickly, and we're both like... Oh, yeah, I was not happy about that, but that was a fantastic film. Yeah, that was the hat trick, bro. Right. I need to eat. Be careful. I collect all my bounties I just earned on that last quest with you. Oh, I should have done that as well, actually. But. Um, it will be available after the cutscene. Okay, cool. Well, I love how beautiful this coral reef place is. It's so beautiful. What was the password? Five six six five. That's right. Oh man, these deer I believe are fucking beautiful. Is it letting you join me now? No, I think you have to fire the SOS first. Fire the SOS. Whoa, this thing looks like a bloody cockatoo that like is more reptilian? Uh, it kind of looks mammalian, actually. Come down here, you bastard. Far out. Could have made that easier on yourself, but you didn't. I can see... Two, but not yours. Hey, but aren't we on a private server? Yeah, but I'm responding to an SOS flare. All right, I, I'm not able to fire an SOS flare, unfortunately, because I'm waiting for a cutscene to launch. All right. See if you can join me. Uh, see if it uh, gives you the warning cutscene. If we're lucky, because then you'll be able to join me, even though you're OP. Yeah, 
do. I'm just waiting until the cutscene. Cool, awesome. Because I think there might have been a glitch, if I'm being honest. Okay. So I'm taking on a Paolumu, I believe. Oh, hey, what's that up? Th oh, that must be, um... It's either your Palico or Heron's Galleys. Oh my god! Okay, well before I do that, there's clearly a Pelico. What in the heck? Is that big blue orb the Paolumu? I thought the Paolumu looked more like a bat. Oh, it can inflate itself, I see. Ooh, that's yuck. Oh, that should make me feel uneasy. You can now fire an SOS. But you should be able to just join me, yeah? There's an idea. No. I'm a coming. Oh, yeah, that was silly. Another Pelico has gone. I feel like a right tool now. Gone ahead and just gone falling off there. Okay. Getting back into the fray. The world of Frey. Awesome. I probably could have used my fucking insect glaive to get over. But I did it. This Paolum is putting up a hell of a fight, man. Yeah, come on. <laughs> no, 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 I'm not having a go. I'm saying this this Paolum is like really giving it its all. We can catch wing drakes to chase after it, can't we? Yeah, and the photography raptor is chasing after it. <laughs> it's like, it's me, photography raptor. What 
The photography raptor is just walking away. He's just been Craig David over there. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, yuck. Come on, mother blucker. Oh, I'm trying to. My slash just isn't kicking off. Cool. There we go. Oh, you have got one of the cloaks. Yeah, the vitality one that takes. I take no damage. Well, is there a threshold, or is it just there isn't? Yeah, what? Fine. What the fuck is that thing? Is it Articuno? It, it looks like Articuno. Yeah, that's Articuno. Oh my god, do we have to kill that thing as well? Yeah, eventually. Just scrapping it out right now. Holy oh. fuck, it's beating the fuck. Holy shit, the <laughs> oh shit! A thousand damage. Bro, are you taking it on? Nah. No point. Oh, it just punched me. Rude. Where's the Palumu gone? Oh my, it, 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 yeah, it. That thing is legit Articuno. How do I get rid of Ice Blight? Do I just roll around? Uh, Nullberries. Oh, yo. Who's ever heard of a Schnazberry? I don't have any Nullberries. I guess I'm nully fucked. Yeah. Needleberry. Is that the only way to get rid of it? Yeah. So I'm just gonna die otherwise. No, your, your stamina is gonna be real low. That's great. So why? Where's the Palumu gone? Where I am. Why aren't my bugs ticking off and telling me where the fuck to go? Is your circle around your map red? Yeah. Is that why? Yeah, that means you're still in a fight. Probably gone the wrong fucking way. That's great. So that means by the time it's died, I'm going to be uh, nowhere near it and not be able to carve any items off it. It's uh, fantastic. Yeah, I'm giving them the business, so. Yeah. Oh, for fuck's sake. Tell me where I need to go, you stupid flies. Oh, I take that as a personal insult to me. What, about the stupid flies? No, no. Uh, it hit me and I actually had to heal for once, so... Yeah. I had to go like this random place. 
to finally get rid of the red status around my fucking shit. Spaces. Fuck, that's great. I'm really happy. If there's one thing I hate, it's the day's status. I hate the day's status so much. Because it's just watching your character look like a shithead until you die. Yeah, the way you get out of it doesn't seem like it does anything either. Yeah. And photography raptors here and just blasted everybody. Hilarious. All right, let's go. Need that honey. Yo, where are you going? I'm so far away from this fight. This thing takes forever to go into a flurry status, so... Eh? Come on, you bloody ugly looking bastard. Oh my god. The animation is gorgeous, man. For that fucking thing around his neck. Yeah. Alright. Well, how did you do that? Aim it and press sickle. No shit. It's a way easier way of getting around the map. Oh my god, that's so cool. He's fucked up, he's asleep. So a lot of people, they put down bombs when they go to sleep. And then blow yeah. the bombs up from afar. Oh, this crap. I 
Oh my god, is he gone again? Oh, he's come back. No, what he's up to? Well, he's gonna try and dive bomb us. Wouldn't actually be the first time that happened to me today. That's awesome. I'm really happy about that. Nice work, awesome. Oh, well, I guess I could just farm some of its stuff some other time I fight it. <laughs> it's so good. It was just the fact that you died and it was just like one more hit on it and it died and I'm like... Awkward. <laughs> Who's the famous actor that Hormone Monster knows? He did that speech at his like birthday or whatever? Oh, I can't remember. I think my fucking this show is amazing. It's so good. I think my favorite my favorite scene is probably um when uh thingamabob thinks he's gay and they have that huge ballad with that guy who sounds a lot like Freddie mercury yeah <laughs> you got nothing oh, thanks thanks game Is my hunter rack went up to seven. <laughs> At last. The balloons have been rigged and the airship is ready. All well, thanks to you and the airship engineer. We've completed preparations on our side as well. We can depart whenever you are ready. Do I get to name the ship? However, I do have one thing worth mentioning. We never bothered with a test flight. That's not going to be a problem for you, is it? <laughs> no, we're living in you know, we're living in the age of industry. I'll test it. When you're ready, just say the word. We'll make our descent into the rotten veil. Like you don't even know what you're talking about. But yeah, I am going to prepare. I'm going to go quickly home. Back to Asteria. And I'm going to go to the workshop. Don't know why I did that, because I need to go to the trade yard. But hey, you know, sometimes you've just got to do things that you can't remember that you needed to do. Hey, when will you be available after you said you wouldn't be available? When is the next time you'll be available? All of tomorrow. I'll see what I can do. Just play for 12 hours, bro. It's good. No, I've got to do my podcasts and stuff. Um, and, and, and walk the dog and hang out with Jane. So, three hours? By, by Jane Maltzstone, so you can hang out with her online, like Tales of Pirates. Those were the days. Those were the fucking days. I don't know. All I know is that I love you.
Hey, the electro sack that's needed for the grinder, I can get that just randomly, right? I don't have to do the event stuff. Yeah. Cool. Oh yeah, hey, do you guys need have any deliveries that need doing? Oh shit. Okay, what do I need here? We'll need to build a campsite sturdy enough to withstand the sands. Bring me everything on the list. I need two Rathian scales. Is there an investigation where I can farm a Rathian? Urethian or Rathios? Oh, wait. Is, is there like a level up version? There's two, yeah. Um, I'm after a Rathian. Capture all targets. Capture's way better because you get heaps of shit. What? Oh, I don't know what that symbol means. What does a Rathian symbol look like? Could you describe it to me? Um, hang on. Does it sort of look like a fish whipping its tail in the air? Hold up. Hold up. Wait a minute. Dun, 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 dun. I'm gonna add that in. Rathian is green. Yeah. And Rathios is grayish. Uh, hang on, no, it's not that one. Level seven. Rathios is red. Oh, okay. And Rathian is pink. So I don't have any of those. No, that's all good. Spoiler. No, that's all good. Just not plot stuff. Okay, what item is that? The page doesn't exist. Well, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> How about, uh, fuck you in your face? How about that? Uh, oh. Oh, hey, is the new Asdorf movie out? Oh my god, it comes from a black Diabolos. That doesn't sound like fun at all. Nah. So there's still more monsters that I haven't seen, which is good. <laughs> it does uh, further confirm the um, statement of a three-hour, a three-hundred-hour game. Yeah. So that's good. I need to go f do some more fishing at some point. There's some actually really good perks for fishing some like rare fish. Okay, so I've done that. I can fight a Rathian on that level 2 quest. I've got a... Sleep weapon... Thunder weapon... Water... I need to make the ice one... I need to upgrade that, and I need Rathian carapaces, spikes, and scales. So that's a plus weapon. And then I need more spikes to make the higher version of that what is the quest where ah oh, it's a Toby Kadachi where what is that quest where the, that Rathian will randomly turn up and you're pushing the wagon along uh, that was the one of the story one ones yeah because you can redo them, and I'm just like, which one was that? Oh, cool. I can. I actually have a Rathian mission coming up. I'm going to do Royal Relocation. So 
So I'm doing a quest called Royal Relocation. It's a level four quest. Now, advice about Rathian and Rathios. Mm. Watch their fucking tails. Oh, okay. Do they use it like an Ankylosaurus would? They do. They fly up into the air and mm -hmm. they do a backwards flip and it poisons you and takes off half your health and knocks you across the fucking room. Right. Okay. I shall bear that in mind. Okay, uh, so in your item box you want to have antidotes. Okay. I'm taking antidotes and herbal medicine. That's the that's the tear up, hey. Yeah, that also uh, does a little bit of health. Okay, These so are like the ongoing monsters that have been in every single game, and holy shit, they don't get any easier. <laughs> okay, cool. All right, I'm ready to rock and roll. Boom boom. I like how story quests, if you want to redo them, they get put into the optional. And all it is is just the same quest without cutscenes. It's pretty great. And this is my favorite track in the game. The Wiggly Litchi activates immediately, eh? Yeah. It's a stamina boost. Yeah. Fuck yeah, it is. Whoa, what? Is it because you've you've hunted it so often? Yeah. Because it like just insta activated. Yeah. It's down there. Yeah, it is. This is where you get wave and eggs from, and uh, that's a fun mission that I refuse to do a second time without somebody else helping me oh you have to you have to steal its eggs and then run away from it without cracking the eggs <laughs> that sounds like ancient like kung fu training or kung fu rather <laughs> Robert Baroff, Ian. <laughs> it's 
That's what my ex used to do. I was like, what's that blue light? And then I remembered. That's what that blue light is. Walk in, you two shot it. Hey, hey, I'm trying to get my research rank on you up. That's a bit of an unpleasant fella, ain't he? Now, considering he does poison damage, I guess he's poison impervious. Yeah, he he actually did. I need two Rathian scales, so hopefully this one quest does that. Can we take it off? And it's, yep. it's alright, we're still doing damage to it. Does he stay in the spot usually? He doesn't fly away or anything? Flies away. Oh shit. I see what you mean about his tail, man. It goes for gold with that fucking thing. Screams, fireballs you, and then tail whips you all at the same time, and you're like, if I got hit by that, I'd be dead. <laughs> and the other person you're doing it with is fainted, and you're like, ah, uh, cool. Is it a pain, like, um, playing with randoms, bro? Yeah. Go away, go away, go away! Expert level dodge. It's a pity. Yeah. A pity. Uh, bosses don't work quite the same way as they do in DS, where you can just stab them in the bum constantly. Yeah. That's my favorite thing about Dark Souls. I base most of my attacks at the Grundle area. <laughs> Wait, is that why she's called Gruntilda in Banjo and Kazooie? Cause there was a lot of adult jokes in rare games. Uh, I fell with this fucking tail in the tree again. You That's alright. We can still do damage to it. What the fuck is blocking my attack from his tail? Oh, it's the uh, fucking it's mountain! Yeah. You dick! Dude, having my booming gl glaive at level 2 finally is amazing. Not having to like whetstone my shit like 10 seconds into a fight is a great feeling. So the way that my weapon works is because I've got the um, oh my God. perk for my armor perk. Mm -hmm. um, there's a green bubble around my armor and my weapon so it won't get blunt until... The bubble disappears? X amount of yeah. That's pretty cool. Oh, this is where um, the, uh, the Rathian goes if monsters invade its territory. Yeah. Cuz, let me jump on your back. Fucking hell. Oh, 
fuck. It was the first time one of those things got me. Bro, can you just come down? So I can fucking jump on your back? Thank you. Oh, there's something so, like, fucking therapeutic about fucking poisoning them with your blade. Oh fuck, I'm poisoned. You dick. I cut his tail off and mounted him in the same turn. That's fucking cool. Like fucking badass. Seven damage to the chrome. What hunter rank do I need to be in order to unlock the next half of the um, blacksmith? Uh, I think it's after you defeat the Sora Magdros. Oh, right, okay. Because I want to fucking OP the shit out of my blooming glaive. He poisoned. Yeah. Fucking. Right, let's drink it. Thanks. Hey, hey, hey! Bloody hell, young fella. Uh, you can't tail with me now, can you? You ain't got no tail. <laughs> yeah, that's legit what he was going for as well, and he's like, oh shit. Yeah, we fucked them up pretty oh, Just come down, bro. Covers tail. I already have. I did it as soon as you took it off. Oh, right. Oh, yes, because I mounted it. Yeah, because I was just like, well, he's already preoccupied. I don't really need to be there. Hang on. What's wrong? Hang on. Let's, before, before you go do anything, mm -hmm. just do one thing. Mark him. Is there a rare drop? No. Follow me. And you'll see a world of pure imagination. I'm sorry, I stuck one of the greatest musical tracks of all time in your head. I'm really sorry about that. There is no life I know. Fuck, they butchered it with the remake. The remake was awful. Like, I like, like you know, certain characters that uh, Johnny Depp plays. But yeah. Fucking hell. <laughs> he needs to stop taking jobs with. Oh bro, for real, him and Burda need to fuck right out of cinema for a bit as a duo. He should just go back to doing what he used to do, which is like horrible life-ending claymation. Dude, yeah, or like, he he really was like into the macabre, and now he's like not. I don't know why he decided to make himself like one of those directors. Like his Alice in Wonderland is shit. Great. I've only got 20 seconds to get there. I caught it. Oh, you caught it? There's no cut. I, there's no coming. I caught it. Oh. Whew. I was like, why? What did I do wrong? Look at him, he's like, what the fuck is happening? Whoa, the bonus rewards are incredible. Yeah, that's why you catch monsters instead of killing them. Well, I just unlocked a whole heap of shit because you caught it. 
I got a new arena quest. Wait, is that what capturing does? We put them in the arena. Yeah. Dark, eh? Yeah, that's so that's fucked up. You don't only catch them to fuck them up. You catch them and then you kill them later <laughs> so you can fucking oh, that... more of this shit. <laughs> that's fucking yuck. But that's so what we would do. <laughs> Thanks, humanity. No problem, kid. You gotta grow up someday, kid. <laughs> Bobby Big Nux is rummaging around in this fucking sack. <laughs> fucking... Right, did you get the items you needed? I'm assuming you did. Yeah, I sure did, so I need to head back to base. Pure imagination. That's awesome. Thanks, ma'am. I'm gonna have to start doing that. It's just fucking straight up. I'm gonna go back to the first ever quest and just start catching monsters. Bloop, bloop, bloop. Wait till you get to the high rank ones. Well, and then you have to capture those, and you're just like, this is great. Well, with a plunder blade, which mm -hmm. you should Google uh, how to get because you've got Coral Highlands access. <clears throat> Pardon me. Um, that plus capturing monsters. Yeah. Is how people have got to, like, hunter rank 40. Okay. Plunder blade. I love how in this village, the home village, there's just like people just hanging out. Oh my the god! Blade. Did you find out what the plunder blade does? No! I got five of the item I needed because you captured it. You're welcome. Oh cool, I found a guide. Okay, I need to... Okay, cool. So I can't get it until the um, Rotten Vale. I like how, like, NPCs in this game are, like, unbelievably useful. Hey, here's this cool shit. Do a quest and I'll give you some randomly epic shit. What's that? Found five pieces of fecal matter? Here's some cool shit! <laughs> like, uh, okay. Wow. This game is so cool. I like that the Beast Story is interactive. Because like, I like the Beast Story in the Final Fantasy series. But it's just like photos. And you're like, cool. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna do one more optional. Oh, I've just unlocked four more optionals. I'm gonna do the story. Okay. Yeah, you do the story one. Let's pump you up. Yeah. Pump up the jam. Pump it up. You're feeling like strawberries on toast. Oh, actual though. So much sugar. This jam is so bad for you. No, but I was just thinking of just like just strawberries on toast, not jam, just. Just strawberries. With a little bit of fucking, like, a little bit of icing sugar. So, like, buttery toast with some fucking straw. Oh my god. god girl. Yeah, I know, but you know. Because of genetics, I'll be so, like, oh, here's diabetes. Oh, cool. Thanks, genetics. Genetics are all good, cuz. I got your back, my yo. Just so you know. First, we need to look for a place to touch down. Once we reach our destination, you may depart and camp, make camp preparations. Then it's back to the usual order of business. Find Zora Magnaros' trail. Now, I want you to pay close attention. While you're down there, think long and hard. And then, actually think about something else to make it soft and not hard. What is the Rotten Vale? How does it connect to the Coral Highlands? Well then, off we go. Did you play Dark Souls 1 or Demon Souls? 
Well, remember those uh, towns you go to that are filled with poison? That's probably what this town's going to be. And Demon Souls is way worse because not only is the town littered in poison, you have to climb down these ladder bridges to get to it. And if any enemy hits you as you try to descend, you instantly die. The servers for Demon Souls go down soon. I want to go through it again. I'm on New Game Plus 8 on Demon Souls. Okay, I've got an attack gem. Defense, Drain, Fortitude. Oh man, I need this Plunder Blade. Wait! Are we making the research base float? I thought we were building a new airship. We just stuck balloons on this. <laughs> what do you think? Hmm? <laughs> Very well. What the fuck? I love how like we didn't even build like a proper functioning ship. We just put some balloons on this broken ship. But it should be alright. Chuck it in there. Sid from Final Fantasy 2 is just like, what the fuck? There. Heads up. Well, that's a cool looking monster. The Great Garros. That's like a quadrupedic cobra yo can I carve this Cool. All right. I wonder if I can send out an SOS for you to come. Hang on. Let me. I was fucking around. Let me have a look. Oh, no, it says you cannot it's right now. No quests have been posted, apparently. Well, oh, that's crazy. You're an exposition. You're in a thing with a guy. Mm. Stuff. That's correct. What the? That monster. Oh, it did die. I was like, that monster looked like it died. But then I. <laughs> watching the actual cutscene, it appears it very much did do that. Okay, so hopefully I should be able to send out a, a flare. No. Oh, there's a... Then again, I'm not really that afraid of insects. So if they scuttle, like fucking those ones, that's the worst. But like sm slow moving insects, I'm just like, oh, I'll just put you outside, bro. My favorite is like insects that have evolved to look scary, but are actually like the dumbest insects ever. I like that wild poogies like have like algae for fur. And all the domesticated ones just look like pigs. Oh shit, I'm literally in an area that's going to poison me to death. Yep. Yeah. 
I need a Vigor Wasp, bruh. Where did they get these Vigor Wasps from? Like, legit. I don't know. Where did Princess Peach pull Toad from all those times? Uh, Six, you don't want to know the answer to. This, this is true. What's the fucking thing weak to? Okay, now that this has been sighted, can I send out a SOS flare? What's the um You cannot use that right now. What's the red thing in the top right corner so? Complete the expedition. Sight a great Gurus. Investigate the rotten veil. There you go. You have to do that. Oh, I keep forgetting about that. If I cancel the animation, I don't heal. Bro, how are you, a giant snake monster, poisoned? Like, I'm happy it's happening, but still, that's confusing me. Yeah, but you could poison a snake. Eh, yeah, that's a fair call. It's not, it's not actually, like, a fantasy monster, I suppose. I see what you're trying to do here. You're thinking to yourself, if I put this guy into the Ephilifium Vapor, I'll just poison him. Well, I'm gonna tell you, uh, her rather. Well, I'm gonna tell you right now. That's not gonna work on me. Why are these other girls here? They're not even doing damage. They're just looking at me menacingly. Can I break this thing's teeth? Its fangs? Hey, that's very unkind of you, alright? Fuck, I should go find chairs. I don't want to need a third fucking set of hands here. Oh, this is so cool. Bitch, I broke your teeth. How do you feel about that? Oh, God. I hate when you're locked onto a creature, but your character isn't aiming at them at all when you're swinging your blade. It's fucking annoying. Don't run away. Oh. Yeah, I know what you're doing. You're using the fucking vapor to kill me. Which is smart. I'm gonna give kudos to that, my bro. I love you still think that's a viable option, using your, like, teeth to try and gnash at me. Bro, one of them is gone. Oh, 
October 26th. Oh. Something I haven't done today, which I normally do every day, is check Mighty Apes daily deals. Yeah, they got some hidden deals on today. Never seen before deals. Mm. Walking Dead deals, comedy TV deals, food and drink clear out. <laughs> well, I wonder which one you're going to go to. Oh, you dick! You eating this fucking monster to heal? Fuck off, bro. Straight up. What a dick! I can't believe that! He actually ate it to heal. What a cunt! That's infuriating. No, I'm not going to go that way because there's fully poison there. So you come here to me, or this isn't happening. It's an ear necklace. <laughs> Bobby Big Nuts! That's so cool. He rode the Vigor Wasp to me. Mm. An entire box of Reese's Pieces mini butter. Mini, mini cups. Whoa, ha what? Really? Yeah, it's $30. <laughs> How many pieces? I mean, um, what do you call them? Items? 16. 16 times. 70 grams. Wow. Comedy TV deals. Family Guy, Brooklyn Nine Nine, Mash, Robot Chicken, Just Shoot Me. Ah, Just Shoot Me. That was a show. Anyway, that was not the thing I wanted to go on Mighty Eight for. What am I on about? It's just shoot me the one that had David Spade in it, and they worked at like a magazine firm. Yeah, yeah. I may or may. It was crazy. Yeah. <laughs> it had like a hidden fucking door out of his office, like a hidden elevator in his office, because they'd go it was like, oh, where's Jack? Jack's in his office, and they go to his office, he's not here, and he's like, I've been sitting here since 9 a.m. I watched him walk in at 9:01. <laughs> March 7th for Bravo team. Yes, indeed. Days gone, Detroit and Death Stranding do not have release dates yet, though. No, because Detroit, uh, they're like talking about. Then they're still in talks about what the rating is going to be because people are having a cry about it. You showed domestic violence, and I was just like, it's fucking art. Do you know there's domestic violence in movies and TV shows and in books and comics? So video you know, games, the only ones that are not allowed it. One of Kelly Clarkson's songs is about domestic violence in the household. So like, Do don't come at me with that shit. What? Saturday Night Fever yeah. has a violent sexual scene, including the hero, and you're just like... <laughs> what? <about> dancing. <laughs> hey, I'll put a status effect that's eating away at my health. And it's not poison. Who the fuck is days gone out? Apparently it's been optimized so that even the non PS4 pros will be able to play it without shit in the bed. You don't go to sleep on me, bro. This fight's been going on for far too long. Come on. I've had enough of your behavior, mister. No release date. That new Spider-Man looks incredible. Game. Yeah. The, uh, one or the normal one. The normal one. Oh yeah. 
Yeah, but all Spider-Man games have been good. Yeah, that's the crazy thing, eh? He just seems to be that character that that is just incredible to make video games for. I really wish they could nail the formula for Superman because I'd actually love a, a good Superman game and get Paul Denny to write the story. Thank you. Or we'll get Bruce Tim involved. Get both of them involved would be even better. You know, biggest can't be choosers. Later that same evening. Oh my fucking goodness. I found out where I'm supposed to go. Guess, guess what? I had to keep filling up that bar that said you know question mark monster left this mark here yeah and now i'm fighting a rabidan and you can't help me because you're in the middle of a quest and you're late yeah and i'm late well i'm gonna cross my fingers that fucking monster is bullshit and i'm pissed off at it there's no weird way I can fucking fight this rubber done. I'm gonna have to send out a. I have to send out a um, SOS. What do you mean you can't use that right now? I need to. He's clearly too strong for me. You have fun. <laughs> I'll try. Catch you later, man. You have fun as well. All right, fam. We're all alone. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, I'm so glad it's poisoned. What? Sonic the Hedgehog! Flippity shit. Come on, come on, come on! We have to do this. Oh shit! Big giant stupid looking eye. Damn it.
Why? Seriously? What? What is it doing? I should have brought a trap with me. That'd have been way better. Man, this thing is not doing too well. Come on, we can do it, Bobby Big Nuts. Don't let it get away, boys. Come on. I really fucking hate when you can't attack it where you want to attack it. That's awesome. That whole time it was on the ground, I could do, like, literally no damage. Come on, we can do this. No. I like when it's poison, when it's running away.
I'm so doing an investigation with one of these damn things. No, come on. I really wish I brought a trap with me. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do an investigation where I trap this motherfucker. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be huge. Oh, why the fuck am I getting a call now?
I'm so glad that's over. Okay, who the hell's this? It's you two. Um, have we met? <laughs> Sorry, I forgot. You were out cold when I found you. I'm from the first fleet. You folks are lucky to be alive. Uh, hang on. She must be the one who saved us! Oh my god, thank you, thank you! Just glad you're still in one piece. Fifth Fleet, am I right? <laughs> what are you doing out here? Actually... Hmm. Mm. This is from Zora Magdaros. I'll see what I can find. I've spent years delving into this valley's secrets. And I'm starting to understand a thing or two. Now it's your turn. Learn all that you can about this place. Next time we meet, we can compare notes. Sound good? Yeah. We're on the job. Good. See ya. You know, I think Silent Protagonist worked really well in the SNES era. But I honestly do prefer voice acted characters. Or like characters with the potential to be voice acted. Like just not Silent Protagonists. Which is weird because in Dead Space 2, I really hated that Isaac Clarke started talking. So, you know, maybe I'm just a hypocrite. Anyway, if there's no cutscene after this, I'm going to call it a day and wrap it up. Okay, here we are. No sign of Zora Magdara's trail. Disappointing. I suggest you descend further. The effluvium levels will be more toxic. But that's not going to be a... Sorry. That's not going to be a problem now, is it? Just say the word when you're ready. Yeah. You should prepare before going down to the bottom of the rotten veil. There might not be any turning back once You know the handler? I'm not gonna go there. I'm gonna head off for the day. You guys have yourself a good one.